Hi, Shyam. Nice to see you sent us another set of essays. Well done. Let's see what you did in this set. Okay, the first one is the letter. Let's see what you wrote. Dear Sir Madam, I am writing this letter to place an order for a new i7 processor. Well, and rather than saying of Intel company, here's a better way to say this. A new Intel i7 processor where you use Intel as an adjective, right? It's a better, cleaner way of doing this. I am Shyam Rao Pawar, the inventory manager at ABC Company. Uh, although we have placed an order for of no an order for two thousand i seven processors earlier, um, considering the demand for laptops s embedded with this processor, we might require um, to four thousand such processors. Uh, the customers are extremely happy with this cutting edge technology and demand their laptop be assembled only with this exclusive product. The sale of our laptops, S, have been skyrocketing. Uh, get rid of it also. Uh, and led to a threefold increase in our profit. Okay. Currently, we have an advanced booking of 1,000 laptops and expect, not expecting, a surge in demand in the near future. I request you to process our order swiftly. Uh, in order to meet the demand of our existing as well as all the fut potential future customers, we have made an advance payment of $1,000 and the rest will be paid after delivery of the entire batch. I look forward to your prompt response. Okay, fine. Why do you need it? Why do you need... Okay, fine. All right, it's um, it's well done. It was certainly um, developed and... Um, accurate and on topic um so i have no real problems with it just some of the uh grammar was a little funny you saw um i had to fix some of it um other than that i thought you did a pretty good job really i mean it was quite quite appropriate okay um just those little things the little grammatical things that were a little awkward i want you to look at them and be a little careful okay let's take a look at this essay now about studying about working before studying okay all right, so let's look at this one about working. Here we go. Taking a gap year for work before tertiary education provides a considerable amount of benefits to students, yet there is a drawback, a completely drop in the option of education. I strongly believe that a break from studies before university education can be beneficial for students. This essay will discuss both sides, using examples from Indian government and Harvard University to demonstrate points and prove arguments. Lovely, no problems, well done. Okay, let's move on. Um, yes. On one hand, allowing students to work before completing... Let's hold on one second. It's, you say that a break is beneficial and you will look at both sides. Okay, fine. On one hand, allowing students to work before completing education can encourage them to drop the plan of future of further education. Um, this is largely because if they become addicted to earning money, then it is likely that they will get diverted, ED here, and discontinue their education, especially students who belong to lower socioeconomic backgrounds. For example, an extensive study by the Indian government stated that, uh, you didn't need a comma here, in 2018, 30% of students out of those who took a gap year did not return, get rid of the ED, back for higher education. Thus, it is conclusively clear that work before university education can tremendously reduce the number of qualified graduates in a country. Okay, that's well done. Uh, on the other hand, there is ample evidence um, which suggests that doing jobs prior to university education will help develop students both personally and professionally. All right, that's nice. The central reason behind this is twofold. Firstly, students will get ex not an exposure, but they will just get exposure, okay? Uh, two, look, here's what it should be. Get exposure to the working world at a young age, at an early age is fine, and therefore enable them to choose Mm, to, you could do this, to wisely choose the fields for studying while pursuing further education. That would be okay, all right? Um, let's see. Secondly, they can become independent and learn a crucial life skill of financial management. For instance, empirical research by Harvard University demonstrated that 80% of students agree that their reason to take a gap year was to obtain a better understanding of the world and become financially educated independent. Consequently, it is it can be stated without doubt that obtaining work experience before higher education will have a positive impact on 
these students life okay from the arguments and examples stated above the merits of working prior to university study outcast i don't like that word outcast it's the wrong word here okay it's the merits in the future numerous countries will encourage their students to follow this practice okay so you could see that i got through it rather quickly i mean you've definitely learned the template the grammar was for the most part good it was um there was nothing really particularly problematic i like the whole thing actually um I think that if there's anything I want you to try to work on a little bit in order, the, the area that I would like to see a little improved here would be your vocabulary. So there were a couple of areas where you had some nice vocabulary, but let's talk about what could have been maybe, I don't know, just a little better. So you had things like tertiary education, which was nice. Um, but then there were some word choices that, weren't so great like this one addicted to earning money um divert which was wrong what you really meant here is it, it then it is likely that they will get distracted and continue their um discontinue their education or you could have said that this will uh, take them off course and they will discontinue their education so there were other things you could have talked about um i like things like lower socioeconomic backgrounds um let's see what else um yeah but the rest of it there wasn't really anything that made me say you know wow this is really high level writing great so that's what um i'd like to see i want to see some areas and you know it doesn't have to be topic specific a lot of times it's just the the words of the essay itself that um really just kind of raise the level here okay um I'm trying to think where else you could have done something. I'm not really sure, but that's basically my my comment to you. I would like to see the 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 level of the vocabulary just a little higher. Um, like I said, again, there's nothing wrong with your vocabulary, but again, if you're aiming for one of those higher band scores, to see some kind of more um, academic sounding language, some less common words would be nice. All right, so go ahead, correct these, and let's see another set of essay. Uh, I liked the. Um, I liked the uh, the way you extended it. The topic development was good. So keep on working like this, and uh, I will wait for your next set of essays. Good luck.